Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here. Coming at you with episode 509 on my TTMO day. This is a recap video for Thursday and Friday. Um, sorry, I just couldn't do a video yesterday or Thursday. Um, the alternator went out of my car and I was working on that all day yesterday, uh, right after work. And I got it all fixed, so it's all good. Um, car's running just fine now, so that's awesome. Um, but I uh, do have some things to show. Um, I had a couple c that came in on Thursday. And uh, also, I think, three from Friday and a couple of return to senders that I'll just get out of the way first. Um, this one's coming from hockey player Hubie McDonough. Um, the weird thing is, lately all my return to senders begin, they have like no sticker. I mean, this one's stamped, but. The other ones have literally no return to sender sticker, so it's like, well, you know, what happened, or was it really return to sender, or what? Um, so, I don't know what's going on with that address. Uh, Mickey Coon, um, I'm guessing. And I saw people are getting return to senders from right after I sent. It might be because of the hurricane, which uh, is definitely uh, thoughts and prayers go out to the families from Texas and Florida um, with Hurricane Harvey and Hurricane Irma. Um, definitely uh, keeping them in my thoughts and prayers and to you guys that if anybody's living there uh, to YouTube family and and everything I just uh, wish you the uh, wish you the best and uh, definitely stay safe if you if you have an opportunity to get out because uh, I know it's been really hard that people really can't but uh, if you can then if you think you can definitely take it um, other than that, hunker down. Um, I pray that you know maybe the model is wrong. It'll miss Florida, and maybe go back to the Atlantic Ocean, or it won't be as bad as they're saying it is. Very minimal damage, or no damage at all. Um, that's what I also. So uh, again, just uh, thoughts and prayers go out to uh, everyone uh, in Florida and Texas. So, anyways, uh, he was a child actor from uh, Gone with the Wind. So, uh, I don't, if, uh, maybe I'll be able to send to him sometime in the future, um, after, you know, all this strange weather we've been having this summer goes away. Um, then the successes, so this is from Thursday, sent, uh, with a $5 fee, this is to Mac Burke, former Philadelphia Phillies catcher. Uh, I don't know if he actually charged $5, it saw, you know, some previous successes that they did send him money and some that didn't. He signed anyways, so I mean he might still sign, but I figured for five dollars that's reasonable. Let's uh, let me just make sure that uh, you know I respect his wishes because he probably still would like that five dollar fee. I figured it's worth it because again, guys from the fifties, uh, there's not too many of them around, so uh, it's always cool to get them. And this is really cool. I really love this one for the Rockies. Um, I remember watching this game, and I fell asleep like maybe a bat or two right before him. Um, this game went in the extra innings against the San Francisco Giants. The bases were loaded. Ryan Spielberg came up and he hit a walk-off grand slam to win the game. And uh, eventually um, they did end up going to the playoffs in 09. That was our last playoff appearance. And hopefully they'll be able to do something this year. That'll be really cool. But uh, as you can see, all kinds of guys that aren't on the team anymore or, or who have moved on to other teams. But uh, definitely blast from the past there. Uh, he's currently doing work for the Rockies uh, announcing on Root Sports so you can see him on TV channel 26 if you're in Colorado and use the Xfinity um, so that's really cool so I see him a lot he's really funny also at a he still actually every now and then does a show uh, Spill the Beans with Ryan Spielborn but he did it as a player a lot and it was absolutely hilarious um, he was just you know already getting to that role of uh, television and uh, announcing so it's pretty cool to see his careers uh, going well in there so he was one of my favorite Rockies for sure then we got uh, Todd Jones I sent to him uh, he sent this, his uh, testimonial card which is really cool really good closer I remember watching him in a few games uh, power right hander struck out a lot of guys uh, could gas it up you know mid 90s high 90s a lot got him of course he played the Rockies for at least a season or two so I had to get him with the Rockies this is from 02. So that was really sweet. And then I sent him a photo. 
I have a Bowman Heritage card. The Tigers. Look at that, you know, sweet mustache right there. That's pretty cool. So, uh, very happy with that one. Uh, really cool to get him back. I've never sent him before. I did, I think I might have purchased his autograph a long time ago. And then I got a football return sent kind of like in the middle of spring, or not spring training, uh, preseason to a, a really good linebacker, one of the best in the NFC, uh, one of the top tacklers, Ryan Kerrigan from the Washington Redskins. A uh, really good player. So that's pretty cool. That came back a lot quicker than I expected because a lot of times he'll take, you know, around a year or so. But uh, he is a very good signer to his fans, though, if you want to send. Uh, he usually gets back to you. Then I think this is the last one I sent to uh, Dolly's little sister. This is Stella Parton. She did not sign my photo, but she did send a pre-signed 8x10. Um, she ha she does do singing and has also acted just like her sister. That's pretty cool. So she sent this 8x10. Uh, paid for the shipping as well, which is really nice of her to do. Um, the only thing, she, she did use just like for one stamp, she used the uh, my SASC, which is perfectly fine, and then threw a few extra stamps on there to make sure it got to me, and, and uh, you know, didn't get bent or anything, so that's always plus, so I really appreciate her doing that, it's really cool of her. Um, I do have a request out the dolly, and hopefully um, any day now could come back, and uh, that's it guys, um, thanks for being patient, and this video going up, um, you know, obviously with my car, I wasn't able to do a live mail opening, but hopefully today I can do that, if I have some TTMs. And uh, hopefully, you know, you'll see me later this evening. So talk to you guys later and have a great weekend.